Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. We're doing the first Cultic Cube Draft. This is an interesting one. This is created by John Terrell. Terrell? Thank you. And uh, Unseen Spectre, thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. What's good? How are you, my dude? Always a pleasure, man. Thank you. Oh, Shua Gardner, what's up? Welcome back. Get busy drafting or get busy crafting. That doesn't even make any sense. Wait. Mike effed up the screen. Oh, dang it. There we go. We did it. Thank you. Omar, what up, my dude? <laughs> Thank you so much for the prize, sub, buddy. Oh, man. Love it. Dude. Good seeing you, my, my dude. <sighs> oh, man. What a pleasant surprise. All right. What do we got here? I think I want Obnixilus. Scratch my chin first. Um... Agonizing Remorse also real good. Thought sees at one is good. Thought sees at two is just fine. Have you seen Watsy's new draft? I mean, it's just a regular set. It's not a draft set. I'll take Obnixilus. I'm a big Obnixilus fan. Finally got my work balance at home just right so I could drop it. Man, Omar, I've been waiting for like 10 years. It's actually not double the price. It's actually only six ninety nine a pack. I thought that was actually cheaper. <clears throat> when you get away from me, Braska's contempt seems good. I got like another half, three times in three years. I got on my game. <laughs> I believe in you, though. I believe in you, though. I got a half a thing of fries in the bottom of this bag. What are you doing, Arby? What are you doing, Arby? <laughs> Get your fry game on point. I get away from me. Sign and blood could be fine. Hell's caretaker is a little fragile. Uh, could be Gary. Gary. Well, Hell's will probably wheel, but I also don't think I'm taking it anyway. I don't care about it, <laughs> so that doesn't do anything for me. Um, I think we're just taking sign and blood. <coughs> If I would take Knight's Whisper, I think Sign of Blood's also fine. And you can kill. You can kill somebody with it. Which sounds much darker than, than it should. I like a villas.
You're darker than people know. What does that mean? <clears throat> are you talking about the? Shadow are you talking about? Are you talking about the deck right now? Is this Magic Rage Shadow of the Gathering Legends? Yes, yes, it is. Do you know the game The Evil Within? I started to play the first game on the franchise today. Just amazing. It'd be nice to be played by you. Um, I was considering playing The Evil Within a while back. Hold on, I got. Oh man, I, I had a, I had a butt itch. I'm just gonna say go for the throw. I don't know what we're doing here. Like I don't know what we want to be doing here. So I'm actually just gonna like. I I actually this Kraken is is great. Thank you. And I like blue. I like black blue. Boy, don't I. Jocko Makako, thank you so much for the sub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. We aren't here for your butt itch. Yeah, I know. But you get him anyway. It's just a bonus. <clears throat> I'm going to take the battle sphere, I think. Vindicate is good enough to go to go white for, I believe. The is also pretty good. I'm going to take Vindicate, though. <sighs> and then we got a Blood Crypt. Biscuits. What's Patron of the Vein? 4-4 four, for four, 6 with flying. Destroy a creature an opponent controls whenever a creature an opponent controls dies. Exile it and put a 1-1 one, one counter on each vampire. So this is immediately, this is a 5-5? Five, five? I'm going to actually take this and try it out. This is, a, I love like commander, like supplemental set products, uh, cards that, that make their way into cube because they're just, you never get to play them and they're kind of fun. <sighs> Cut my life into ribbons. I'll take cut to ribbons. Maybe we're red, black. Agonizing. Yeah. Okay. It's pretty clear no one wants the black. So maybe that blood crypt and that Badlands come back. I mean, I doubt it. Decaru, what's going on, my dude? New cube time. I think it's just magmatic sinkhole. Oh, dang it. Goblin crater maker seems good. Like, we have no way to put things into the graveyard just yet, and I don't really want to go in on those cards either. This is my first This is my first time playing this cube so far. <clears throat> eh, Slagstorm is fine. Come on, give me that Blood Crypt. I don't know if it's gone now. I have no idea. Uh, <clears throat> John, it's definitely a less combo-oriented cube, and that was, uh, apparently by design. Rimrock Knight. Trusty Machete is actually real good. He says as he puts it in his sideboard. I'll tell you what you want, and I'll tell you what you get you get away from me. White border volcanic hammer, huh? I'll, Decker, I'll trust you. I'll trust you. I believe in you. Oh man, Galvanic Blast last pick? That's basically Lightning Bolt. It's not Lightning Bolt. It's just shock. I'm so sick of seeing cubes where everyone just forces storm. <clears throat> yeah. I mean, it definitely gets, uh, it's tiring. I feel like Vindicate's the only card we're not playing. Man, there was a Badlands and a Blood Crypt in that pack, though, so the fixing is, uh... Hey, Frank, sorry if I was a bit belligerent about the raid thing. I got ferocious, vociferously opinionated when I'm on the crowd. <laughs> Josh, no worries, buddy. I love you, dude. We're good. I love Ugin the Ineffable. Ineffable. Ineffable as well. I'm going to take Ugin. I 
Tesseret. Oh man, this is like one of my favorite Tesserets. This is my this is my favorite Tesseret. <clears throat> what does Territory Hawkeye do? Six five flying haste. At the beginning of combat on your turn, choose an opponent at random. That Territory Hawkeye didn't attack during your last combat. How does this work? Like, can I only attack every other turn? Because that seems bad. Tin Man, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Welcome back, my dude. Could also just take people. I think it's Fable Passage, actually. A 6 5 flyer that attacks every other turn. In this economy? Oh, Island Mountain Plains. I like that the, I like that the triomes are in here. That's nice. Oh god, Dream Crawler. Dream tra Dream Trawler, not Dream Crawler. Dream Trawler is so good. Thoughtseize is so good. Or Thoughtseize and boys. Incendiary Flow, Anger of the Gods. Damnation. We could be a Damnation deck for sure. We could just be like a black red control deck. Let's take a Damnation. <coughs> Metamorph? I'll Metamorph. I never Metamorph I didn't like. Call the Bloodline. Interesting. Let's take a Handwire Garrison. Oh, Hero's Downfall? I mean, it's got to be better than Victim and Fatal Push, right? Well, actually, both of those are cheaper, so you actually save less mana, save more mana if you want to uh, kill a creature that they could target. <sighs> oh, I think push is better. There we go. There we go. Get a load of, get a load of the cube expert himself. Yeah, you might be right, actually. And and I, I'm just more, I was more concerned with planeswalkers because I don't know how frequent planeswalkers are going to be. And I know that I already have two, so we'll see. We'll see. But yeah, I did. I read the article and stuff, and it did say that the the curve is lower, and there are aggressive like red and white decks. So, coffin queen, no hair in the flame dream. Coffin queen is one. No more, no more. No. Eh. Eh, sure. Do you think Wrath of God should have been Damnation originally? Um, I don't think so. I do like Firebolt. And we already have Thought Season Agonizing. I don't know. It's hard to say because... Because Wrath is so iconic now, you know? Like, it's hard to say. Man, this thing attacking every other turn is comical. It's like got phasing. <clears throat> Man, look at these blue cards. That's how much I dislike Faithless Looting. Destroy all non-nug permanents. <laughs> Wouldn't it be destroy all nug permanents, though? I don't think he would spare the nugs. Spare the nugs, spoil the mutual. That's what I always say. Wow, that's great. I like a victim of night on the on the wheel arena. Sing it. Oh man. 
I was listening to I was so I was like actually playing some Billy Ocean on uh on 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 well I guess through uh, the Amazon Echo, and I was like, Alexa, play Billy Ocean's Caribbean Queen, and then when that was over, I was like, Caribbean Queen. Dang, no more love on the run. Alexa, stop! How did she hear that? I was like, Alexa, Alexa, play. How did she hear that? So anyway, the point of the point of this story, I think we're just taking sulfur springs. Um The point of this story is that I said that, and then I was like Alexa. Play Billy Ocean's I'm just making sure she's not listening. I was like, play Billy Ocean's uh Get Out of My Dreams. And because the names kind of carry me and Queen, Get Out of My Dream, like they kind of sound the same, she's like Billy Ocean, Caribbean Queen, No More Love on the Run by Billy Ocean. And I was like, no, that's the same song. Dang it. I, I, we should have another song request stream. You're right. Maybe we can do that tomorrow. Oh, Chandra. I like a Steam Vents, but we're not, we're not blue, so. Anyway, the point of the story is I tried to play I got distracted. I forgot what I was saying. I, anyway, it doesn't matter. We're just drafting right now. Children seems great. I could cast that. We definitely don't need more removal. Like, let's look at all the removal. <laughs> These two? <laughs> I have no idea. Oh, this two? All right, sure. So only 15, only 15 of our cards are removal so far. To this day, many wondered how Frank would finish his thought. Keep wondering, buddy. Keep wondering. What, is this, what does this one do? Each opponent loses one life. You gain a life yield. Okay, so I plus two to do a one point life swing. Negative two, create a five, five, and I lose two. So that's basically like, it's just like kind of like a Sarkon, where it's like you make a dragon, you make a four, four dragon. It's, here you make a five, five instead. You can only do it once. Um, except the plus is terrible. Yeah, I'm just going to take Bone Crusher Giant. Oh, Glorybringer? For sure. Living Death does not seem like something we're interested in. Glorybringer definitely does. I guess Ugin is removal too. Yeah. Oh, actually, so is Patron. So. And so is Shouldred. And so is Glorybringer and Bone Crusher Giant. So, yeah, okay. You know, I guess. I have no idea how other creature decks are meant to compete, I guess. Galvanic Blast is just the worst final bolt, firebolt. Neon Tokyo Rain, what up, my dude? Welcome back. Thank you for the resub. I appreciate you. And all you do. Now I have now I have Caribbean Queen stuck in my head. Caribbean Queen. No in the same dream. Storms Wrath, probably not better than Damnation because it also kills our Planeswalkers. Magmatic Sinkhole can probably go. It's like the, our options are like Removal or a Reanimate spell. I guess we'll just take Malicious Affliction because I'm pretty sure it's just straight up. It's not now. Nah, it's not straight up better than Victim. <sighs> Shock. Kite Sail Freebooter. I like Duress better than Freebooter. Mesa only gets Mountain here. That doesn't seem great. And our only Delve card we, we've taken out is Magmatic Sinkhole, so. I mean, if we had a Badlands or a Blood Crypt, which were in the first pack, I could see taking it. I mean, we'd have to pick up, like, specifically Plateau, or uh, Scrubland or Godless Shrine. 
I'm watching you now and on YouTube. Good lord, this is too much. E to extinction. Lightning bolt. What's Perforos's invention? Intervention. Um, yeah, I don't like that one actually. God, there's so much removal in this cube. It's wild, dude. It might just be endless one. We built this city on rock and roll. I think it's just endless one. Interestingly enough. Cooperation games. Take read the bones. Uh whoa strider. Whoa str two more removal spells. Thank you. Oh, Waylander, thank you so much for the Wow, this is Elite Dak Faden. Take the sob, whatever. We can play that. Waylander, thank you so much for the sub, buddy. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Re really appreciate the resub. Wow, three black cards, huh? This is so much removal. It's unreal. I'll take Sign and Blood out and I'll keep Read the Bones. Wow, another... Jesus. I could just play Mono Red Burn almost. Oh, boy. I mean, Lightning Strike's better than Hammer. I don't think we need both Victim, Malicious, and... Okay, I don't know what you're doing right now. Okay. The Morbid is nice. This is non-artifact. This is not Vampire Werewolf or not. I think it's just better than Malicious Affliction, to be quite honest. I'll take Slagstorm out in case we need it. We have Damnation. Two seven drops, huh? I gotta sneeze. <coughs> Having Endless One, I wonder if Stone Cold Serpent is also in here. I bet one of you guys could just tell me. This deck seems good. I just don't know what to cut here. I just want to cut Damnation for now. I mean, like, we don't know what we're playing against, so. We have Vraska's Contempt, Heroes Downfall, Go for the Throat, Victim of Night. I think we can cut the Victim of Night. Firebolt, Magma Jet, Lightning Strike, Goblin, Crater Maker, Thoughtsea, like, uh, yeah, this seems fine. Let's play it like this. 9-5, huh? Which is weird, because we get 15 more lands. So I guess we'll say 9-6? And we'll just go 8-7. Now we're sharing the same dream. I like Crater Maker because it does deal with artifacts. Like, it deals with colorless permanents. So, I mean, being able to, sh to shoot a creature or a colorless permanent is pretty nice because we don't have other ways to do that. We don't have, like, a Manic Vandal or something. <laughs> oh, man. Did I start singing Caribbean Queen again? Like unintentionally? Because I don't, I don't, I didn't realize that I did. It's just totally involuntary. Oh my god. Yeah, we'll give this a go. Oh boy, here we go. It's all happening.
Okay. 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 is toast nope let's actually play swamp so we don't take damage and next turn we got ob yeah this worked out well I got mini hero of blade hold hand wire of blade hold <clears throat> oh what's your one drop mother of runes Figure? That's a good one. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, you get in there. Hmm. I wonder if reading the bones would be better here. Can we find a, a card that kills this guy? I mean, because if we play Ob, he goes down to two and they just kill it with the Sky Marcher. No, actually, we can leave these guys back. Yeah, let's do that. Like, they're not really close to um, the City's Blessing. Seven. I mean, I guess if they go one drop, one drop, one drop, then they have City's Blessing and they get to kill Ob, but that seems ambitious. We also get to draw like three cards next turn. Okay, so they played two things. Thalia is kind of obnoxious. Oh, Murderous Cut's nice, though. Oh, boy. I feel like I kind of want both of these. Land? Land would be nice. I feel like a third card should be a land. It was not a land. I think we can just pass here. Well, if we attack with this, they can block with this, forcing us to cut it. And I'd rather not have to do that. I mean, we are probably going to kill Thalia anyway. Depending on what they do. I mean, we, kind of kill, we have to kill Figure of Destiny too. But we can do that with Glorybringer next turn, so long as Thalia is out of the way. Yeah, this is fine. No more love on the run. This guy. Get this guy out of here. Seems good. Blue jean, baby. <laughs> LA lady. 
Attacking our Mixolis. Went to the trash can. I think you're dead, man. I got to again to get your germ. Ballerina, you must have seen her. Oh, Antibody, thank you so much for the continuing the gifted sub. I appreciate it, my dude. They're like, ah, oh, forget it. I can't even block. So this is where we want the slag storm and the damnation, I think. I feel like if we just board on all these cards, like it's impossible for us to lose. The Boulevard is not that bad. Ballerina. I can take out Metamorph. You must have seen her. Dancing in the sand. I think Remorse and Thoughtseize are probably just better as removal spells. You know what? <laughs> I like to live dangerously. Oh, they went to five, and we have a damnation. That's basically the end, right? This is the end. Ding, ding, ding. My only friend. The end. This is the end. Ding, ding, ding. Uh, no, I don't, that, that step was just weird, like, I think it was just Magic Online fucking up. Initial thoughts on, I mean, seems fine so far. Sing a, uh, uh, sing a song with the word danger, please. Huh. See, look, now we have an answer to this, if we ever need it. So this is why we, this is why we Crater Maker. This is why we make the Craters. They're going to Thalia and equip. Are you ready? <laughs> Figure in the sand. Oh, they didn't attack? You know why? Because I got that. Two, two. I got that two, two. And all in the highways, and in the howling room. Highway to the danger zone. I'm just going to block here and make you use it. You got a 4 4, huh? What do you get when running on somebody? I got Dungeon Master's Guide. I've got 12 sided die. I've got Kitty Pride and Nightcrawler, too. Waiting there for me, yes I do. Okay. I've got Ace Freely. I got Peter Chris.
Yep. Oh, see, this is just just gorgeous, right? Getting that free damage too. Ooh. -ee. Kill them all. Uh oh. Hero Blight Hold? Yeah. Hero, here's Downfall. That's not it. Okie dokie. That's a yikes for me, dog. Let's not forget our opponent went to five on the play. That is unfortunate. Second from the top, I guess we're just going to be drawing that guy again. We're going to lose to one Gideon. It's going to be brutal. Man, Indestructible is pretty good. It's your boy, old Handwire. You singing my karaoke jam? Man, in the garage is like one of my favorite Weezer songs. I think it's I think it's probably my favorite Weezer song. So the answer is yes. Boy, the draw's been very good. I like it. Get him out of here. <clears throat> oh, what up, McGimp? McGimples? Oh yeah, Weezer's Blue Album is definitely listenable from beginning to end. I mean, I don't like having to do this, but... You forced my hand. Gideon is way too good. Dang it. Ugh, God, let's read them. Give me them bones! Oh, Slagstorm seems good. Oh, Magma. Oh, let's keep both. Put on top. Put on top. Make. Oh, God. I'm so bad at this game. Oh, God. He's so bad. Um. Put on top. Put on bottom. <laughs> Come on. Look at this, stupid. I mean, it shouldn't matter. Like, they're not going to have a white haste creature, and we got rid of Lightning Greaves, so. I should be fine, but it's the principle of the thing. Oh, my God. So many Gidgeons. Oh, well, that's good. Let's get him while he's not indestructible. I kind of want to get rid of this, but we can just get rid of it next turn. So I guess that's fine. Also, we got a 5-4. Sure. Well, 
Well, I don't know if we do it before we activate it. The, the card might be better, but... We're also at five. Five is not a lot of life. But Ugin, the real MVP. Well, it also could just be telling they have nothing in hand. Like, I don't. I think Outlast is good value. Like, I don't think it's like if they have a two drop, they're still going to Outlast because it's. Well, I guess they're going to play the two drop too. But I mean, they're also at like a very, they're also at 15. So like I would probably outlast first because it makes this guy bigger and it makes a free token instead of playing like a three drop. So they could also just be holding a land. Like there's tons of things they could be holding right now. And I kind of just want to slag storm here. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter, right? So this is five, six, seven damage, eight, nine, ten, eleven if they don't play a blocker. So it does give us lethal. That doesn't matter. All right. Our deck is kind of sweet. UPS tracking, USPS tracking info has been down all day, and it's really kind of frustrating because I'm trying to track some things. I will play first. This is good enough because of Magma Jet. Yeah, having an abundance of removal spells that you have to cut like five of them uh, to play your deck is probably pretty good against the aggro deck. Because then you just put them back in. Sure. Living in Grixis or living in Jund, which would you choose? Oh, God. Probably Jund? Those both sound terrible. Those both sound absolutely terrible. You got it. Well, cool. Babe, I love you. I hope we can get a black. That'd be great. I guess not. <sighs> cool. Having a good time. Let's bring in Duress and Distress. Take out Firebolt. And that's it.
Snap it off. Let's get a black. Okay, you got it. Duress for a duress. PC Joker, take it easy, buddy. Have a good afternoon. <laughs> never don't have, like, literally never don't. Two for two. Man, they never don't have Thraben Inspector either. Oh, I like Bone Crusher. I'm not a huge fan of Lightning Strike here, though. Cool, cool, cool. So they have six cards to our two cards. <laughs> uh, okay. Glorbringer. Mm, that does nothing. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay. Bone Crusher's ready. Are you going to target this guy? Sure. Well, if it's a game three, I could always board into a bunch of burn, I guess. Well, they kept whatever card they wanted on top. Was that really your best Macho Man? Probably not. Uh, did I say it was my best? Wow. Very presumptuous. Hey, look, we found the Glory Bringer. Good for them. Yep. Sure. Oh boy. Uh, 
mean, they have answers for literally every card I've played, so. Yep, cool. All right, let's go to game three and hope it's not nearly as miserable as game two. Oh, what up? Nature's Little Treasure, otherwise known as Juposhi, who is no longer signing as Juposhi anymore. What's that about? Sure. <sighs> we get a red here because our double red cards are sooner than our double black cards so we have less time to draw a second red than we do to draw a second black Well, that's unfortunate. What does this do? Draw a card and then discard. It's just a looter? Okay. Jesus. Uh, which one is this? Teamer? Teamer Trial? Uh, we can kill this. Living Death seems scary. Skin Run that we don't care about. Okay. Seems good. Juposhi, can you please explain why you no longer use Juposhi even though you got your account back? I'm real curious. That dude's dead. Maybe he lost it again. Maybe. Oh, we don't know we don't have any of the cards in your hand anymore. Shieldred and Supreme Will. I bet Shieldred's coming back in some way, shape, or form. <laughs> oh boy. I think that a counter spell. I do think they're reanimating, so. Gonna kill this. You don't need to have things on the board. Oh, loot in response. They always do. I don't think I've told you about my quarantine distraction yet. I've been cooking so much. I was thinking of you watching a recent YouTube video because I just made about three pounds of chicken parm and a fresh loaf of focaccia and uh, pain all. Paint, pa I, I never, pan, pan all, I never know how to pronounce that. Uh, chocolate for dessert, all from scratch. Uh, we have, we completed the raid, the raid download goal, like, three days ago. It was pretty wild. Man, manned, maned, maned? Play him as a maned? I don't know what's going on right now. Can I just get a swamp so I can play this ob, schmob nixilis? Now you're gonna get it, Bobby Nix. Oh, for fuck's sake. It's okay, we got this guy. It's all good. It's all good. I'm also sorry you can't send me the chicken parm. You're ignoring my Juposhi questions, and I'm getting real curious. Black? Okay. And we're still gonna glory bring here. Bugok! Glory chicken attacking that Jace. Oh, he did. This is where they go reanimate shoulder and I sacrifice my glory bringer with and I play Ob Nixilis. I kill your shoulder. I have two planeswalkers. I did lose a glory bringer though, but it's okay. Look at all these triumphs. We're running with the triumphs of the night. I also believe in Glory Bay. I can be whoever I want. I bet he's just logged in as nature's little treasure on those 
on those accounts and he's just like, I don't feel like switching it. Oh, that's that's pretty unfortunate. Yep, that's annoying. No, don't like that. Oh, and they exerted it? That's fucking wonderful. Non-dragon, buddy. Non-dragon. Alright? That's nice. <laughs> you happy? Buddy, it's not... You don't have to use it. I was just curious why you hadn't. Now you're gonna get it, Bobby. Let's draw a card and lose a life. Ooh, read them bones. Them bones, them bones. Read the bones, them bones, them bones. Read the bones. I mean, I'll probably kill it next turn. Or I can just find something with which to murder it myself. <laughs> uh, you know, something like that. I'm basically multiple man. Jamie Madrox? That's wild. Well... Saw that coming, I guess. And these are the <sighs> Yep. She gotta go. And then like we can play like I don't wanna lose this now. Just killing all my things. I guess we could just actually go. Mere Battle Sphere, accept Ob as a loss, and then try to win with Battle Sphere. I mean, if we, because we don't get a kill spell, like we're putting a lot less pressure on the board. So. X Factor cut there? I don't know what you're, I, don't, I actually don't know what you're referring to. I think you may have mis mistook me. Man, my own Glorybringer has killed two Obnixiluses. Nixiles. Despite being, uh, incorrectly exerted. Let me read them. Oh, deep X Factor cut. I got you. X Factor. Yeah, okay. I was thinking like X Factor was a show and maybe I quoted it. That's not what you meant. Who else knows that? Hey, buddy. I bet lots of X Factor aficionados know about Jamie Madrox. <laughs> My words betray your eyes. They do. I didn't want to. I didn't want to rub it in. I'm gonna I'm gonna nug him with my jet, nug him with my jet, nug nug him with my jet. Ring my bell. Okay, so cards like Firebolt and Lightning Strike not doing a tremendous amount. I do like Distress and Duress. Seems like those could be very good. Kratomir can go. Actually, they do have like some looters. We have a lot of answers for, like, a shoulder. We have Patron of the Vein. I think that guy kills any creature. Yes. Patron, Murderous, Ob, Vraska's Contempt, Hero's Downfall, Go for the Throat. That's, like, six. That's a good amount, man. This hand seems okay. Mm -hmm. 
Guido Carousella, that is strong guy, buddy. Don't try to trick me. Don't try to come at me with your X Factor trivia. I read comics in the 90s. He's got, he's got a tiny little head. Did I follow Age of Apocalypse? Yeah, but unfortunately Age of Apocalypse was during a time that was like... Comics were trash. The 90s have such a bad taste. They, they have such a bad taste in my mouth. Are you going to counter my hand while Garrison? I got his haircut recently. I need I need pic, I need pictorial evidence of this. Dang. Yeah, I do enjoy a hand wire garrison. Okay. Get that dude out of here. Yeah, 90s books were rough, but I think the 2000s really, really came through. I mean, the 2000s had some of my favorite times in comics. Like, they had the Bendis run on... This is the same game, right? I play Chandra. They play Jace. I, Glorybringer, kill the Jace. They copy my Chandra. Did you enjoy the DC Marvel crossover? As, like, kitsch comic material I did, but not, like, as, like... Oh yeah, let's do this. Let's show me what you've got. Gristlebrand, Woodfall Primus, Collective Brutality. I'm going to take Collective Brutality. These two I don't want in the graveyard. Jace takes a turn to get going. Collective is the only thing that lets you discard immediately. I mean, some of my favorite things from, like, the 2000s to current is, like, anything Brian Michael Bendis did. Like, Brian Michael Bendis was fantastic. Anything that Jonathan Hickman did in Marvel. So we have, like, Bendis' run on Daredevil was one of my favorite runs ever. Mark Wade's run on Daredevil was fantastic as well. Um, Secret, Secret Invasion, Civil War, Dark Reign, Dark Avengers. That whole era was mind-blowing to me. It was just so good. Where like Norman, uh, Norman Osborn just takes over the, you know, the the head of as the head of Shield and like, just so good. Affleck's run on Daredevil, not as good, not as good. And then like Jonathan Hickman's run on Fantastic Four and Secret Wars, like. Jonathan Hickman's great because, and like New Avengers and, and Avengers, like Jonathan Hickman's great because he crafts these stories where it's like, you don't understand what's going on for the first 20 issues. And then the 21st issue, you're like, oh, wow. And it's really impressive. And he just has this way of like making it all come together. Making it Thank come you. together. Chicken run unofficial. I always say unofficial because it looks like chicken run unofficial. Chicken run official. Thank you so much for the reset, buddy. I appreciate you. Let's X all the top card and see what it is. Maybe it's a removal spell. It is. It is a slob Nixilis. Oh, I got a tar pit. Oh, dang it. That's going to that's gonna hurt. That's going to hurt. So the hand is Gristlebrand. Oh, dang it. I didn't see the tar pit. Yeah, Hickman's run on Secret Wars and the, the the Avenger stories leading up to it was just so good. I think Obnixilis is better than Chandra, but what do I know? Oh. 
Oh, interesting. Yep, you got my swamp. All right, so you got a grizzly bee. I would have actually discarded the grizzly bee because if you actually draw reanimates, well, I guess because you have, you only have, se yeah, you have seven lands. I guess any other land lets you just play grizzly bee. I want my grizzly bee, grizzly bee, grizzly bee. Grizzle, baby back bristle. This is an exile, so we want to save that for Woodfall if it comes out. Both of these straight up murder gristle brand. So I am just going to do one of these jobbies on you. Any creature card in the graveyard. That's pretty good. Roll if you want to. Something good. It's not terrible. Agonizing Roar seems great. I want to bottom this because we kind of have something like that. I think we just take this Gristly Bristle. Because 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, they're one man away from just casting Gristle Brand, which is not ideal. So I guess they're going to draw Dread Return now instead. Hmm. That's pretty good. It's pretty decent. It's actually not that great, right? I feel like it's better for us. Maybe not. Yep. So now we... I guess we can go Heroes Downfall, Magma Jet, and we just have to deal with their 6-6. Six, six. Okay, that's probably better. There's no way to exile that guy. What? <sighs> cool. I mean, that's how it works. It doesn't say exile it instead. It just says exile it, so. Yep, that's fun. I mean, this is, like, again, like, this is the first time I ever played this card, so I'm not, you know, the interaction is... I guess it's obvious. I mean, it's, I guess it's not terrible. Like, we lost a, a land, but now we can profitably block this guy, so it's not the worst. But they also have Jace, so they could just living death here again. I don't think that does anything, though. <laughs> yeah. I mean, let's just get Garrison, and that's it. Like, we get Garrison, they get nothing. I mean, that might attack for five and then Living Death, and then they get Woodfall Primus back. No, they don't, actually, because it gets exiled. Yeah, so we're 100% blocking. Uh, I believe this is game two. I think we won game one.
Oh, they just cycled their triome? All right. In these triome times. Mm, I guess I'll just take it. Four six. <sighs> Have you able to? Yeah, I've had a cube built for about four years now. Um, God, how do I get like? Do I just hear us downfall this and attack Jace? Jace would go to one, which turns them off of being able to living death again. So, all right, that time we're good. Eh, just gonna play the land. We have one card, so if the tribe gets discards, and then we can just magma jet chase, or we can creeping tarpid. Okay. Yeah, but magma jetting Jace doesn't do anything. I'd rather just deal with the creeping tarpid. Like I can just kill Jace with my with my creatures. <laughs> oh boy. Yep, that's pretty good. <sighs> uh huh. Must be nice. So they had to hit Bond of Revival and Shieldred. Seems good. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's not lethal. And this guy's dead anyway, so I guess it's definitely not lethal. It's actually Oh, we have one red. Ha <laughs> ha! We have one fucking red. <laughs> oh, good times. Good times. Fantastic. Oh, they get their Jace back. I guess that's fine. Oh, there's also an Inferno Titan in here. So I guess we're just fucking dead, because that was the best Faithless looting I've ever seen. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. That's really frustrating. Oh man. Good times. Everything is alright. Thank you. Two way, thanks so much for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. <laughs> Good times. Everything is all right. One land mulligan. Yeah, we'll keep this one. Oh boy.
Triumph, Triumph Island, Body Double Blade is a charm. Let's get rid of visit charm. Well, not a red land. Um, I think you mean unhinged. Oh, whoa. All right, so try them and try them. Oh, these are the new ones. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, catch a try. Both of those are gone. Island is gone. Ideally, we draw another land. That would be great. Oh, that was perfect. Beautiful land. Well, if we play this, they have both skin render and body double. So, I guess we'll just do this since it's all we can do. Oh, Vigor Mortis and a Metamorph. Skin Render, Doom Blade, Body Double. Sure, let's get rid of Vigor Mortis, I guess. It's the only card that does anything. Is this any graveyard? Yes. Come on, land. Thank you. We did it. So another hand is skin render body double doom body double doom blade Phyrexian Metamorph, so that's like nothing really. Take it to the limit. What'd they play? Sulfur Springs? Oh man, so we still know what's going on. We got such perfect info. Do we want to take anything? The only thing we can take is Doom Blade, which is not exciting. We could play this guy, but then they just skin render it, and then they can actually body double it the turn after that. We're just passing, sure. <laughs> Are they going to body double their Jace? Because that's kind of cool. Excuse me. Body double my Jace. They can't play Skin Render. They can't play Doom Blade. They can't play Metamorph. So. You can't Doom Blade that. You can't Skin Render that. You can Metamorph that. So during my turn, my trigger go on the stack, then their trigger go on the stack. There's a resolve first, making me sack Shieldred. So we can't actually play Shieldred here. Yeah, Metamorph in their hand makes it impossible to play Shieldred. Because they'll just make us sack our Shieldred. And they have enough removal where it's like, well. If 
This dude's gonna get down felon. I think we just ultimate Omnix list, to be honest with you. Four damage a turn. It's, it's, it's a lot. And we still know the four cards in their hand. This is wild. Like, we can't actually hit anything other than Doomblade. We just have no incentive to do that. All right. Like, we just have no incentive to play this guy. Like, we just keep up our removal. And if we play this, they copy it with Battlesphere or with uh, Metamorph, rather. If they if they kill, they can just kill it with Doomblade, then body double it. So, like, our, our ironically, our best course of action is actually... Uh, oh, do we just let them loot? <laughs> The answer is no. Let's play Woe Strider here. They can't Doom Blade. They have to Skin Render it, which is one, two, three, four. Yeah, I think Woe Strider is actually fine here. I guess we can also just take the Doom Blade because we're not doing anything with our duress. Oh, okay, sure. Oh, and we didn't even scry. Yeah, okay, that was pretty bad. I mean, my sub money, not sub money just goes to me. Like, sub money's not money. That's just, I mean, like, eventually comes to me, right? But that's like once a month by Twitch. And Twitch always takes a percentage, yes. I get 350, Twitch gets 150. Okay. Metamorph is gone. What do we got? One, two, three, four, six. We can deal five with this. So they're virtual nine. Okay, you're going to kill my guy. Sounds good. So skin render's gone. Body double's gone. And whatever you drew this turn is all you have left. Hmm. That is fascinating. Is this, wait, this is Metamorph? That's Metamorph. So Body Double is the card in their hand. But, Woe Strider is the only card in the graveyard. Hmm. I guess we just shouldered here? Because body dubs and doesn't steal the creature, it just copies it, so. Thank you. Oh, Super Fritz with a gifted sub. Thank you so much, buddy. You sandwich Maven, you. Is Maven female? I think it is. Mag magnate? Is that the word I'm looking for? No. Maybe it's just an, an expert or connoisseur. Yeah. That was correct. <laughs> Converting my sub money into your sub money. <laughs> oh man, it's that's the that's the circle of sub life. The circle of life. What do they draw? They have body double. What do they Oh, they want to get back either Metamorph or Skin Render. Um No, nah, I'm good. Less good. I guess we gained two. So we got a six. And the only card left is body double. And it moves us all. Are they they're dead, right? She walking through the swamps. Walk walking through the true the swamps. Walking through the swamps. 
draw your card for the turn and then have that dude kill you his name is up next <laughs> I'll give you a good GG's. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me on Twitch.tv slash Frank Patreon.com slash Frank Managers.com. Cool stuff, Inc.com. That's about it, I think. Mana Traders has a great subscription service. You can utilize 20% off the first three months of any subscription with the link and promo code down below. Be sure to check them out if you're looking for that kind of thing on Magic Online. It's great to test Standard or Modern or Pioneer, especially when you can't be going to your local game store in these trying times. So definitely check them out. Slam those like and subscribe buttons, guys. Be make sure to support the channel. And I'll see you next time.